So I'm now doing the orange, which is the second colour on Dark Side of the Moon. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, mauve. I'm now doing the second one. The reason it's taken me so long to get to the next one is because I had to let the red dry first, otherwise it would have blended together. There you go. So let's make the next film. I am painting Dark Side of the Moon on the wall, on the wall for my mum. Part 15. There you go, mummy. I told you I'd do it eventually. And this is part 15. And I make the gap even when I put the next colour on. So you don't have to be too Pacific. Just get the lines as close as you can. And then when I do the next colour, I will tie it in like this. I mean, it's a painting, it's not a transfer. It's perfect that I did it. And you overlap slightly. And this is how to paint Dark Side on the Moon. You have to get a paintbrush and paint, and paint it on the wall. It's the only way you're gonna do it. It's a little bigger as it goes around the wall. It's not really that big. It's kind of pretty symmetrical. It's Pink Floyd, isn't it? There you go. You can see I'm going right around the corner to there. Okay, we're up to the wall. Now I'm going around the wall, as you can see. I just put a little bit too high here, just a little bit. Let's take that off with my sponge. And let's bring it round the wall now. Oh, a little bit much. So you can see I'm going around the wall now. It doesn't matter if I make a mistake on the bottom because the next colour will cover it. But when I make a mistake on the top, I'll just bring it off with the sponge. It's probably more accurate. go. Now I've come all the way down here, all the way to there. I will have to give it another coat, then I've got to wait about four hours for it to dry, then I can do the next colour. But I don't want to be painting this colour with another colour when, when they're both mixed. When you mix colours together, they change colour. When you mix colours together, they change colours. When you mix people together, people change.
So there you go, I've got my second line, the red, the orange. I've just got a little bit higher on the high line, so I'm just gonna chop that off. I'll get my line like that. There you go, perfectly straight. I'm gonna let that dry for a bit. I need to bring the orange a little bit more there. There you go. Right, that's my first coat of the second colour. I'm gonna let that dry for half an hour, have some lunch, then I'll do the second coat. And this is how to paint Dark Side of the Moon. I, pa I tattooed it on my arm, now I'm painting it on the wall. And my mum did this in the 1970s. And this is for you, mum. <laughs>